Well, we've had uh, links with BBC Scotland for some time now since uh, we attended a conference there and uh, there's been a strong relationship between uh, both uh, broadcasters exploring uh, different opportunities. So obviously, uh, due to recent events, uh, when uh, Nicola Sturgeon was talking to uh, Gibraltar's Chief Minister Fabian Bigardo, uh, we immediately started to talk about possibility of uh, sharing sound files, of sharing reports. And then uh, the possibility emerged because Kay Adams' programme on BBC Radio Scotland had been travelling across Scotland uh, just uh, uh, seeking reactions and opinions from the people. Sort of the idea emerged of uh, they wanted to listen to what the people of Gibraltar had to say so we were all for it. And how do you think it went? I think it's been very, very interesting, uh, very happy with it, uh, both at a, a technical production level and I think above all uh, two other things, two important things. One, what it's done for Radio Gibraltar. Radio Gibraltar likes uh, to be at the centre of the community. We like to be the voice of uh, the people and it's just given us a unique insight, a unique opportunity to bring that uh, to the people. And of course, uh, we are very proud to be Gibraltarians, so I think it's also helped the Gibraltar message to get a across uh, to the people of Scotland. What would you say was the main message that came out of the show? I think it's been interesting and I think we've had uh, various uh, opinions uh, like you would expect uh, in a phone-in. I think one of the things that we need to take away is that the amount of people who've called, called in in Scotland had fond memories of uh, Gibraltar or Gibraltar had marked them in some uh, special way. So it's very obvious that uh, whoever visits Gibraltar takes away a piece of Gibraltar with them. They were very fond of Gibraltar and very, very positive comments. A lot of people very hopeful uh, for Gibraltar future of course in the phone in you'll get uh, different uh, points of view some people not agreeing with some of the stuff that uh, Nicola Sturgeon has been saying and doing but I think it's been good to listen to the voice of the people in both Gibraltar and Scotland there were so many nice things said about Gibraltar would you say that was one of your highlights I think one of the highlights uh, for me professionally, of course, is having been able to co-anchor with uh, somebody like uh, uh, Kay Adams, who's been in broadcasting for so many years, a huge professional, and it's just been a, a huge experience uh, for me and uh, for Radio Gibraltar. Of course, as Gibraltarians, I think one of the highlights for us has to be the positive comments that have come from all over Scotland, the fond memories, and I think the uh, genuine support that there is uh, for Gibraltar from Scotland, and I think that was very evident in this programme.